In the world of Office apps, you may be wondering which one should I be using? There's so many options. Well, you know, if you've ever stumbled upon Open Office, and of course, everyone is familiar with Microsoft Office, you're wondering which is the better tool. They both have advantages, they both have disadvantages. Today, we're going to explore them. So, without further ado, let's dive in. So, the first thing we're going to do is jump into Open Office. So, Open Office actually provides a cost free solution for individuals as well as businesses, as it is fully open source software. You can download, share, and even modify the software without worrying about licensing fees. It runs on Windows, Mac, as well as Linux. And it really makes it flexible for users on various operating systems, regardless of your device. And you can even maintain productivity with this versatile tool on the go. Open Office also supports a wide range of file formats, including Microsoft Office files, PDFs, and even legacy formats, which ensures a seamless collaboration and file sharing across different tools. The product is also uh, lightweight and system friendly so unlike heavier software it actually runs smoothly on older or less powerful systems making it an ideal choice for anybody with limited hardware resources the only one or two drawbacks that i can really cover here is that it does lack some advanced tools and integrations um, some of the things that you won't find here you will find in maybe more premium software and then um, the open office development cycle is a little bit slower compared to Microsoft Office and um, even some other office apps resulting in delayed feature updates. All right, so let's jump into Microsoft Office now. So Microsoft Office actually includes powerful applications like Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and even Teams, offering a complete productivity ecosystem. Also, each app is designed to excel in a specific purpose. You can effortlessly save, share, and access files from anywhere using the OneDrive cloud service. It offers real-time collaboration, and it's super easy to use. You can also benefit from constant improvements and the addition of new tools to stay ahead in productivity and innovation. Tools like AI advancements and um, editors, designers can help optimize your work. Also, uh, Microsoft Office, to say the least, works seamlessly with CRM software, project management tools, and a whole bunch more, ensuring that your workflows are a whole lot smoother and overall to enhance productivity. Also, um, with features like Power Query, Pivot Tables, and Advanced Charting, Microsoft Excel actually stands out as a pretty powerful tool for handling complex data sets. The feature really does make it indispensable for professionals. One or two of their drawbacks, unfortunately, their subscription costs. So you will need the Microsoft Office package if you want all of the uh, features, all of the apps. And then also it is a little bit resource intensive, so it can operate quite slowly on older devices. So if you are using an outdated machine, it might not actually work so well for you. Okay, so you see that there are tons of features packed in each one of these applications. The software, they have amazing features. They also do have one or two drawbacks that we need to take into consideration, of course, to make sure that we are considering all things. The takeaway here really is to go ahead and use both of them, try them out, see what works for you specifically. If this really was a helpful video, you can go ahead and drop us a like down below and we will see you next time.